So me, just like everybody else, is having problems with the Pistel X68. Um, mine is leaking here. So um, I just want to show you that. Hear that? Leaking here. Why are so many people's Pistel X68s failing? Um, I think it might be partially user error. If the stock O-rings don't perform well in cold and the user is firing the uh, launcher in rapid succession, changing out a CO2 cartridge, firing again in rapid succession, it might be actually lowering the, the uh, temperature of the O-rings to the point where they become brittle and then fail. That's why I have replaced all of my O-rings with HNBR O-rings that are 90 durometer. In addition, I'm also using some extremely low temperature performance grease from Dow Corning. Um, so between the HNBR O-rings and the extremely low temperature grease, I think this might be uh, part of the solution to the problem. Okay, so um, I took the Pistel apart and I replaced the 11, the 17, the 14, and the 221s in this region and in this area here. Uh, it's working substantially better. I'm using the extremely low temperature grease Dow Corning, Dow Corning M Coat 33 medium better. Let's give it a shot. So you can hear, it's still slightly leaking. If I got to jiggle this patented mechanism and it stops, but it's leaking substantially less. Now I'm gonna fire it. Listen, I'm gonna pull the trigger, fire it immediately. 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 Fired immediately. Fired immediately. Fired immediately. Fired immediately. It's um it's still slightly challenged. But if I if I just jiggle this, it's something in the mechanism here. I tightened the Allen screw in, in the bottom here, but um, it's working substantially better. So it could be that I've been using too much impact force on the piercing cap and uh, I could have damaged it in addition to having the O-ring problems. But um, I'm going to contact MCS and get a new cap for the bottom and just be very careful with it when I, um, when I smack it to pierce the CO2. Um, I, I always am concerned that I don't get a good pierce and the chamber won't fill up with CO2 as well as it would. But um, I think with this patented mechanism, I could be damaging in it. My Pistel was also uh, experiencing a problem where you pull the trigger 
and it would be a hesitation between when you pull the trigger and when the CO2 would discharge. That problem has gone away once I changed the O-rings in the internals. Well, I hope this video helps. Uh, it's try I'm trying to come up with a theory for why the Pistel is failing and leaking and uh, a solution based on that theory. So um, it definitely might have something to do with the composition and the low cold performance of the O-rings. Um, if you're going to tear your Pistel apart, why put in polyurethane rings that aren't going to perform well in the cold. I think the Buna can be brittle. So uh, maybe this is part of the solution. I don't know. I hope so.